When Meghan Markle's pregnancy made headlines, so too did her age. 37 and pregnant has some wondering if this royal baby will be an only child. Many couples end up asking the same question. How long should we wait to have another? I would like a second one down the road and maybe not wait too long, but he's a handful. To lower the health risks for mother and baby, the World Health Organization recommends waiting two years or at least 18 months. But Canadian researchers are now saying if the clock is ticking, you may not have to hold off that long. Based on our studies, it would be worthwhile to wait until at least 12 months. Canadian researchers looked at nearly 150,000 births. They found there are risks to getting pregnant too soon. For women over 35 who conceived another baby six months later, six out of every 1,000 pregnancies had severe complications, including death. For those who waited a year, that number dropped to just under three. And younger women who became pregnant again six months later more than doubled their risk of premature labour. A family that might be considering a second pregnancy about six or nine months after delivery of the first, it might be worth waiting that extra three to six months to, um, to lower risks. We do know that there are other risks associated with pregnancy. This family doctor says the study will prompt questions from patients, but the risks remain small. At the end of the day, women and their partners make decisions about when and whether to get pregnant uh, based on a whole lot of factors, not just medical factors. Along with the health risks of having another baby, most families need to balance careers, finances and childcare. We haven't even considered another, the burden of the next one. Burdens the royal family may not be thinking about. Christine Birak, CBC News, Toronto.